Hi friends, my name is Ina Irby. I'm not a life coach, I am not a therapist, I am a mom. I have disassociated myself as one of Jehovah's Witnesses and I do this every morning um, with you. And hopefully if you find me, you're not alone on the journey. Courage to change, January 28th. <sighs> Newcomers are often surprised at the number of years longtime members have been attending Al-Anon meetings. They may be even more surprised that some of us have sobriety in our homes or no longer have any alcoholics in our lives. Why do we keep coming back? For many of us, the answer is, quote, serenity, end quote. Sometimes I get impatient or rebellious or bored. I go through periods where I see little change in myself and I begin to doubt. But even after many years of Al-Anon recovery, if I miss too many meetings, things seem to become unmanageable all over again. I have been affected by someone else's drinking. I don't want to underestimate the last impact that alcoholism has had on me. So I keep coming back. I came to Al-Anon for a quick fix for my pain, but I stay because of the consistency, security, and friendship I find each day. Because of my commitment to my own growth, I am able to handle very difficult situations with a great deal of peace, and the delight in my life continues to exceed my wildest dreams. Today's reminder, I see my recovery as a healthy way of life that I can gladly share with others. Today, I am actively pursuing a better life because I am working on myself. The quote is from Just For Today. Quote, Just For Today, I will have a program. I may not follow it exactly, but I will have it, end quote. I'll read that again. Just for today, I will have a program. I may not follow it exactly, but I will have it. Courage to change. <sighs> Affirmations for the inner child. January 28th, it's on spirituality. Today I will contemplate the source of my strength. The house is quiet, my heart is not. My children lie sleeping on, the hot, on this hot afternoon. The blinds gently slap the windows. Evidence of my success hangs on the wall before me. Symbols of the love of friends lie here and there on my desk. Encouraging words are placed about where I can easily see them. Yet past successes, the love of friends and encouraging words don't seem to help me break through the uneasiness, dissatisfaction and fear. So I will take time out to talk to my higher power. I need to hand over one by one the things that are disturbing my peace. I give them in exchange for a new peace that can come only from meditating on the source of my strength. I'm going to read that last part again. I give them in exchange for a new peace that can come only from meditating on the source of my strength. Okay, friends, I hope this helps you on your healing journey. Hope you have a good day today. <sighs> Follow your bliss and be good humans. <laughs>